Hey guys, it's Donna and Happy New Year. So for the new year, I thought we would try some new styles. And today we're gonna try Dia and... be fun to try some new styling services here in January to see which ones maybe are some new ways that we can explore some new styles. Um, and I've been seeing Dia pop up quite frequently for me. Um, now Dia is considered a plus size company. However, their sizes start at size 10. And I know for pants, I'm a 14, sometimes a 12. So I'm kind of on the lower spectrum of that. But I still thought that that would be kind of fun. And it goes all the way up to size 32. Um, so there's a wide range there um, for you if you wear plus size or maybe just in the large, extra large range. You could still give Dia a try. Um, there's a $20 styling fee. Of course, like all the other styling services, that does get applied to anything you decide to keep. Um, I do have a $25 off discount in the link below in the description, though. So if it's your first time trying it out, you can get $25 off of something that you decide to purchase in the box. So I think that's pretty cool. Um, the other thing is, is if you keep five items in here, which I think they only send you five, if you keep everything, then you get 25% off the box as well. So you fill out the styling profile, um, very similar to some of the other boxes that we do on here. Um, so I don't know. I just was kind of curious. <laughs> so, <laughs> hopefully you guys enjoy this. If you've used Dia and Co, I would love to know about it in the comments below and what, what your experience has been and whether you've enjoyed this service or not. Um, I'm kind of curious. Um, I saw a sneak peek of the preview, I think, um, and I liked the pricing. So I think we're just going to dive in. If you're new to my channel, welcome. So glad that you found us today. Hopefully you like what you see. If you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you hit that subscribe button. All right, let's dive in before I dilly-dally. I don't tell you the wrong thing either. This is a brand new box for me, so hopefully I'm telling you the right stuff. I'm so used to my standard boxes, um, so that's why I thought it would be fun to do something different. You guys know I love the tape. It's purple. <laughs> so it's got to be a good sign, right? It's got to be a good sign. It's very sturdy tape, too. Okay. So I like what I'm seeing so far. This is what my box looks like. So there is an envelope here that has a prepaid label on here. So I imagine anything that I don't want to keep, I decide to put back in this and it'll ship back for free. The shipping is free both ways, just the styling fee is $20. And then this looks like similar to the trunk club. So it has like a little passport here, um, which I imagine is probably my invoice, but let's take a peek real quick and see what's in here. All right. So yes, so these are the prices. And let's see here, a little ditty about the company itself, it looks like. Um, let's see. So it says, what comes next? Mix and match and make outfit magic. <laughs> Feeling it inspired. Post your tags and looks on my Dia style. Pick your pieces, rate your faves. Need free for shipping. You use the shipping label in the bag. Um, get 25% off when you keep everything. So there must be five. Okay, here's my stylist note. That was kind of what I was looking for here. All right. Hi, Donna. Hello. My name is Mikal. My call, M-I-C-H-A-L, I'm not sure how to pronounce that, I'm sorry. I am excited to be styling for you today. Aubrey Hepburn said, life is a party, dress like it. <laughs> uh oh So turn up the music and have your own party while you try on everything. Mix and match these pieces with your favorites from your closet. Have fun trying on these new favorites in your home. These Mary Sky leggings are a top seller and would look so cute with this Mary Sky Claudine sweater. Now that's a new brand for me, Marie Sky. The cut from the cloth mom jeans are a classic favorite um, and will look cute with the Ryan Wilde sweater and Anita scarf for a fun touch. The East Adele, can't pronounce these words today. Adeline dress is perfect in purple. Oh, purple. And will look cute with tights and ankle boots for winter. Your box is extra jam packed this time. We have included a sixth item for you to try. You still only need to keep five to get the 25% off discount. So thank you to my stylist. Um, what are you looking to add to your closet with Dia? Be sure to leave notes when you rate your items and add any necessary information to your profile so I can tailor your box specifically to you each time. I hope your 2022 is phenomenal. XOXO, me call. Um, you could also go in there and select items yourself. You could give the stylist suggestions. I really wanted it to be a blank canvas since it is my first box. I feel like I need to get a feel for what styles they have and then I can give proper feedback. So I really did not tell them anything. I just kind of filled out the profile, um, told them what I like and what I don't like, but I didn't specifically ask for anything. So we'll leave the prices for the end as well because I don't like that to spoil whether I like something or not. Okay, so I've got two big bundles as you can see here. So let's see if we can pull them out. All right, so here's the first one and I'm seeing that purple there. 
peeking out the top. So let's see what's in here. It does have a cute little Dia sticker on there. Let's see here. Let's see how you did, Dia. Okay. So here is that Mary Sky brand. So this is a dress, I believe, is what she said. Okay, that's cute. I actually just recently got a burgundy dress like this. Um, so I have high hopes for this. And this size is a 0X, so I guess we'll see. That's the other thing I'm playing around with is the sizing to kind of see if really any of it will fit me. Um, this one here, again, 0X. This one is by Ryan Wilde. This was the sweater that she was talking about. Let's tissue paper down a little bit. Um, it looks a little long, but it might be cute with some leggings, which I think she mentioned was in there, so we will see. I do need some nice sweaters. Hopefully it's not itchy. Oh, I like these colors. This one's by Mary Sky as well. Oh, it is kind of a mock turtle though. Mm, I like the colors though. So it's got the purple and like a light blue stripe here with the navy at the bottom. It's so soft. I hope this turtleneck doesn't bother me though. I have a thing with things on my neck. E so I don't know. We'll, we'll see. I'm, I'm keeping my mind open. Keep my mind open. Okay, so there's three items. There's my next bundle and I see that scarf peeking out there. Maybe that's why there's a sixth item. It's because she put a scarf in. Lots of fishy things, oh my goodness. Okay, so let's peek at the scarf here. So I'm not sure. It's folded inside out. Here we go. I don't know about leopard print. I don't do much animal print. I'm pretty sure I put that in my profile. Um, but it's very soft. Um, it does look like a bigger like blanket scarf is what it is. Don't know if I can get the whole thing pulled out. No, it's not a blanket scarf. It's just very wide and long, but I don't do animal print. So I don't know. Do I need cheetah in my life? And how do you know if it's cheetah or leopard? I've always had that question, but I don't know. It is soft. It is very pretty. I'm just not sure if it's going to be my style. Okay, here's the leggings. And unfortunately, the scarf got all of its fuzz all over it. Um, but these are by Mary Sky again. These are the leggings that she mentioned in that bio. Um, it does have side pockets. I like that. Um, that would be cute with some of those sweaters. So that's probably what I'll pair those with. And here is a pair of jeans. All right, what are these? These are by Cut From The Cloth. I've tried Cut From The Cloth. Um, the only thing I'm worried about is the um, the back part. I feel like I have gaps in the back, but we're going to try them and see. So, all right. So I'm excited to try on some of these new brands. Um, and then we'll get together at the end and take a look at the prices. So hang tight while I try some of these on. Okay, so here is the first outfit that I put together. Um, let's talk about the gray top. So it is on a larger size for me. Um, the armpits are a little bit too low um, and the sleeves are kind of baggy. But if you like the oversized sweater look, I think that this is really cute. Um, I also think the length is really nice with the pair of leggings that I put them with. Um, but the sleeve length is too long for me either way. So I think even a size smaller is not gonna help me with that. Um, you can exchange, I saw on there. So if the sizing is not right, you can see if they have it available for you. Um, but I do like it. I mean, it's a nice quality. It's not itchy, which is nice. Um, it has a nice, I think, weave pattern here on it with kind of like that chevron and the knit um, look here. So I think that's really cute. Um, like I said, the length is longer in the back. So I think it is meant to be worn with some sort of pair of leggings of that type. So I don't know, just if it was a little bit tighter, a little bit smaller, I think it would be great. All right, let's talk about the leggings. <laughs> so surprisingly, the leggings are too small for me. <laughs> so they're actually squeezing me here. Maybe I had too much um, Christmas and New Year celebrations. I don't know. Um, put on a couple extra pounds, um, but it is squeezing me here. So I would have to size up um, in the leggings. Um, I don't remember what these were. If there was zero X, I can't remember. Um, so I would have to size up. They're okay though, apart from that. They are a nice um, material. They're a cotton material and they do have these side pockets, which I always like. Um, and they're very high waisted though, so they would cinch in everything. It just doesn't feel comfortable on me. So of course I can't keep them. So maybe on the price, I do like the style though. There is like a line running down the center here, um, which I think is really cute, adds a little extra dimension to it, but they just don't fit. So, all right, let's move on to, I think the jeans and that purple top. So hang on. All right, so second outfit, um, let's talk about the top first. So <laughs> I actually do like the coloring on it, but this is not gonna work. So I just don't do turtlenecks 
if you do do turtlenecks, I think this is really cute. So, I mean, that's totally your preference. I just don't like that. I never have, never will. I'm okay with the cowl neck because it's open, but the turtleneck's a no-go. Very soft, though. I like the style of it as well. It lines up very nicely to the purple, I think, on the sides, which adds a nice little element of style there. I don't know about the length either. Um, it definitely does not look right with jeans that I paired them with. I feel like maybe a lighter colored legging would be really cute or a cream color to match this would be really cute on the bottom half. Um, you could really bunch it up. Um, a lot of my viewers are like, why do you pull everything down? But this one, you just don't have that option. Um, unless you bring it up completely and fold it over. That's not bad, actually. That's kind of cute. Um, but you have a lot of extra fabric there underneath um, that I just don't think is working right. So unfortunately, as soft and as cute as the colors are on this top, I think I'm going to have to pass. All right, fit-wise, it fits very nicely, though. Let's just get rid of this turtleneck. <laughs> there we go. Perfect. <laughs> All right, so the pants. I'm not sure about the pants. They fit very nice. Um, the waist is really nice. Um, these are a 12W, um, but they're kind of baggy in the thigh area and the crotch area is a little bit too low. Um, it has some nice light distressing here, but the ankle's a little awkward where it hits. Um, but I mean, they are cute. I just think they're a little too baggy for me um, where I don't like them to be baggy. I like my thigh area to be tighter um, because it kind of holds everything in. Um, so unfortunately, I think the jeans are a pass as well. They are really cute though. Got two pockets in the back, of course. So, all right, I'm curious to see what that dress looks like. So, hang on. Okay, so here's the dress. I love the color. It's a really nice purpley plum color. And it's actually kind of a loose fit, which I like. It feels doesn't feel like it's snugging where it shouldn't be snugging. Um, and it's not showing extra rumples where it shouldn't be showing extra rumples. I think this would be really cute with a longer necklace, possibly, and a nice bracelet accent piece here or statement piece. And maybe even some longer earrings. I think that this would be really cute. I like the length of the sleeve. Surprisingly, the dress is kind of long. I mean, it's definitely below. It's more like mid-thigh. So I went ahead and paired it with my boots. Um, to see what those would look like. And you kind of see a little bit of my leg, but not too much, which I like. So, I don't know, the dress might be the winner. What do you guys think about this dress? I like the pleats too. I think that adds a little nice extra element there um, of detail. So, it's really cute. Maybe it'll blow it down to the price. I wanna try on the scarf for you guys. <laughs> I don't know, I'm just not, like I said, leopard print just isn't really my jive. I know a lot of people, like to wear these longer scarves with belts. So you could wear it like this, and then you could tuck a belt here. Um, almost like a um, cardigan, <laughs> that's what I'm trying to look for, with the cute little belt here. Um, I don't know, I mean, you could just use it as a shawl, I guess. Um, there's so many different ways you can wear scarves. I think it's just a little bit too much to drape around uh, my neck. I'm just thrown off by the pattern, I think. <laughs> I think you either love animal print or you hate animal print. I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments and then let's get together real quick and look at all the prices. So, hang on. Okay. So, I think I liked this box. <laughs> I have to work on some fit issues, but that's normal, especially with new styling service and new brands for me. You got to play around with the sizing, right? But let's look at the prices. Let's see how well they did in that area. All right. So, we'll start with the scarf. I don't know. I mean, maybe I need this in my life. It is very soft, which is surprising. It doesn't look soft. Um, and I'm looking at the price and it's a very nice price. So hmm, maybe we'll see. This one is called the Anita Scarf. This is charcoal gray and yellow. Um, and then this one's $19. So my styling fee would cover this and I wouldn't have to pay any more money because that $20 would cover that. So it's an option, but I just don't know how to wear it. So help me out. Leave me some comments. Let me know. All right, this dress, that's what's next on here. So this really pretty dress. This is East Adeline is the brand. Miriam tiered dress in purple. And this one's $59. I don't know, that might, it's a nice dress. I just don't know how often I would wear it for $59. And it is pretty simple in terms of the material and makeup of it. So I'm gonna have to sleep on that one and see. Let's talk about the jeans. I have them sitting here. These are cut from the cloth. Ava mom jeans. I didn't feel like they felt like mom jeans, but maybe that's why they were kind of loose where they were. This is a medium wash in size 12, and these are $89. They just didn't fit right, and I don't, I think the waist fit fine, so I wouldn't change the sizing either. So those I'm going to have to pass on. All right, this top that I wish wasn't a turtleneck. <laughs> Let's talk about this one. All right, this is by Mary Sky. This is Claudine striped tunic sweater in white and purple. And this was a 0X, and this is 
it didn't have that turtleneck, I think I could have made it work. And it's a really nice quality. I'm gonna have to be on the lookout for this brand though. I really do like this brand and I think it fits me nice. So we're gonna have to pass on that one. All right, how about the leggings? So these here are the Mary Sky Lorelei Pocket Leggings in black, and these are $39 pretty good price actually um especially if you could use that $25 link in the description below you could get these leggings for a really great price um I would have to size up on these though probably to a 1x uh, for those to fit properly so no surprising but there you go and then lastly the gray sweater this one's by Ryan Wilde this is the Kelly Cable Knit sweater in light gray in a 0x and this one is $65 unfortunately this was too big and I don't think that I can size down from a 0x that must be maybe the lowest size so Fortunately, that won't work either. The total box though, if I were to buy everything, is $330. And then um, I actually had a coupon, so to take the styling fee off, and then a full box discount would be 25% off six items, which would bring it down to $82.50. And then the total for the whole box with that discount off would be $242. And, 50 cents. and again, you could take one of those items off and still get the 25% discount is what the stylist said. So it actually could be less than that. So I think for the quality, the prices are there. Just don't know what I should be keeping and what I should spend my money on. So help me out. Let me know. Um, let me know if you've used Dia before and what your experience has been. I really would like to know with these new boxes, um, whether it's a styling service that I should continue. And don't forget the link below to save that $25 off of your first box. All right, that's all I've got for you guys today. Make sure that you hit that like button if you like the video. Always subscribe, click the bell reminder so you see all the videos when they come out. Till next time, guys, happy styling.